So, this is my photo from my very first year of wrestling. This was just like a random template that they placed and imposed like on our team photo, but it says Olympic gold medal winners, state wrestling champs, the best of the best. And this was my very first year of wrestling. Like this is like 1994, 95, I think it says on the back. No one knew at this moment what I could be, what I could accomplish, how far I'd go in this sport. My name is Jordan Bros. I'm from Sicklerville, New Jersey. I am a freestyle wrestler for the United States of America. I'm an Olympic gold medalist and four-time world champion. When I first started wrestling at six, I was successful fairly quickly. You didn't need a ton of technique or physical prowess to be good at a young age. When I got to high school, I struggled a little bit with that transition. I was relatively small. It took a long time for me to physically develop and have the technique and the skill set necessary to compete at the highest level. Won a state title as a senior and then got a scholarship here to Nebraska, um, here in Lincoln, and even struggled in that transition here to college. I was relatively unknown as a freshman, so kind of operated in that obscurity as a freshman. Then my sophomore year, I was an All-American. I finished third in the nation, and then my junior and senior year, I was undefeated national champion both years. So leading out of that period of time, going from college where I was a champion my junior, senior year to go into the senior level competing at the World Championships and Olympic Games, I had so much confidence in my abilities and I was physically developed, I was strong, I was powerful, explosive, I was confident, I knew I could win. I realized I could be one of the best wrestlers in the world. Win the day, that's been a mantra that I continue to live by because I know that looking at the big picture sometimes can be overwhelming. This is where I am and this is where I wanna be and there's a ton of work necessary to get to that place. And so this big gap has to be filled with consistent effort over a long period of time. And the way to do that without getting overwhelmed is to, for me, just break it down to incremental steps, smaller goals that I can achieve daily. How good can I become today? So before every wrestling match, Lauren, my wife, writes me a note to just encourage me. It says, my love, be stingy. Those are your points. Be determined. This is your team. Be fearless. No one can stay with you for six minutes and be sensational. This is your home. This is your crowd. This is our city. Living without compromise is huge. It's huge. To be exceptional, be excellent at anything, you have to live without compromise. There's so many distractions in life, things that'll weigh you down, knock you off course. It's like I've set a goal for myself, nothing's gonna knock me off course. This is what I want and this is what I'm gonna accomplish. No compromises. I'm Jordan Burroughs and I win the day without compromise.